The possible therapy is based on a medical concept called passive immunity. People who recover from an infection develop antibodies that circulate in the blood and can neutralize the pathogen. Infusions of plasma, the clear liquid that remains when blood cells are removed, may increase P. Opal's disease, fighting response to the virus, giving their immune systems an important boost. The approach has been successful against polio, measles, mumps and flu. The recovered people could have in their blood something, that could be very useful, said Arturo Casadevil, Chair of Molecular Microbiology and Immunology at Johns Hopkins Bloomberg Jewel of Public Heal, TH. The history is this has been used in 120 years in medicine, and it is well, known. Casa Devil is hopeful the treatment, called convalescent plasma, could provide short-term relief to a medical system that faces a surge of patients, with no approved drugs or vaccines. But he and colleagues face regulatory logistical and scientific challenges to set up a process that will ultimately be limited in how many people it can treat. Researchers must collect blood plasma from people after they've recovered, then test it to determine if it is likely to be potent against the disease and deliver it to p. patients. Infectious disease specialists are sharing information through grass, roots networks, helping each other with clinical trial designs and ideas on how to screen plasma for virus, fight, in antibodies, 